In order to watch and understand this video, you need to set the view speed to 0.5 times speed. You've got five, four, three, two, one. Let us begin. Today's video is a bit strange, but trust me, it allows us to exploit the YouTube algorithm and do something very, very silly indeed. So YouTube generally, of course, recommends videos based off of percentage viewed and watch time. This is, of course, a great sign that a video is good and not clickbait. But my video is going to break this metric by having double the watch time for each viewer. Watch time is the time that you spend watching a video. So if you watch a four-minute video at two times speed, you've only added two minutes of watch time. But my video is going to break this metric by having double the watch time for each viewer because you're, of course, watching this at half speed. For every one second of the video, you're adding two seconds of watch time, which effectively doubles the watch time that you add as a total. So instead of watching a maximum of 100% of the video, you're now able to watch a maximum 200% of the video, all thanks to watching it at half speed. Now for the YouTube algorithm, this video is incredible. You love it so much, you're watching it twice as hard, and that's a sign that it needs to be recommended to way more people than it logically should. So thanks to your viewership together, today we're breaking the YouTube algorithm. Feel free to go to the comment section and write down which view you are on this video because it's likely to grow very fast and introduce thousands of new people into the wonderful world of exploiting everything with this spiffing grit. Now is it viable to deliberately increase the video speed to make viewers watch it at half speed? The answer is no. Beyond a silly experiment like this, the loss of audio and visual quality makes it a much less comfortable viewing experience. But if you still want to buy 100% audience retention on watch time, then why not try out YouTube Shorts or watch my live stream of many exploits where we explain how to break audience retention on streams? And there we have it. Today, ladies and gentlemen, we're going to break YouTube. We're going to do it gloriously, and it's all thanks to you. So let the chaos commence as this glorious video redefines YouTube better. Not at all, because no one else is going to do this. It's just too silly. But hey, I'm British, so it pays to be a little bit silly. Let the carnage commence. Thank you.